Yo, what's good, everybody? It's your boy Goofball Gaming back again with another video. And today, yes, it is time for the ultimate filter. Now, this, well, I'm gonna give you four filters that will change your life. I swear on my life, I made a million coins in a day using these filters. I will swear on my own life that I actually did that. I'm not even kidding. These filters are so OP. I don't know if they still work on your server or not. On my server, man, they lit. I So let's get straight into it, man. First filter here. These are all revolved around one filter, except for maybe the pro pack one, which I'm going to show you guys later. But here we go. The first filter you want to do is AN. You want to type in 20K and you want to see if you can get anything good. All right, so there's Brian Dawkins, there's Herman Moore, and that's pretty much it. All right, so there's nothing that dropped that round. You want to snipe Herman Moore if they're really cheap. You want to snipe Brian Dawkins if they're really cheap. You want to get some Anthony Munoz, which is really rare, but it drops sometimes, and you can make a ton of coins off of that. And, of course, you want to get the ultimate one, Randy Moss. So these are the four players that it gives you. All right, this is a really good filter. I've used it a ton of times, made me a ton of coins, all right? Brian Dawkins and Herman Moore have dropped down in price the last couple of weeks. So I highly recommend getting Anthony Munoz's and Randy Moss's as fast as possible. All right, next filter you want to do is you always want to follow on who the new legend drop today is. All right, so today it's actually his name is Ed Jones or Ed the tall one or whatever. So we're going to get him and we're going to go for around 60K. We're going to see if there's any collectibles up. Um... No, but there's players here. I don't want that. Uh, let's see. There's no not enough for 60k. What about 70k? All right. So you always want to follow. So there's one whatever for 70k. All right. But that's not really worth it. You always want to follow who the new legends are, and you want to make sure you want to snipe them as soon as possible to get as many coins as possible. All right. So all these filters are revolved against the legend collectible filter. All right. Next one you want to go is you want to go. Uh, this is kind of a filter where I do it afterwards. So uh, after my sniping round, I go around and I look at every single position. I go QB, I go wide receiver, I go uh, HB, and I just try to look for some of these that nobody has picked up. I OT, um, like, like for OT, you know, you want to look for Munoz, uh, you go DE, uh, you want to look for Juwan Curse. There, none, none there. Not really surprised. Niche for MLB. LB, you want to look for Kevin Green. Um, there's a ton of Ted Hendricks here. Now, Ted Hendricks, on the day it came out, actually was worth 40K. So, it's really important to actually snipe the collectibles on the day the player is dropped. All right? You want to go CB. And the last but not least, after CB, you want to go safety. All right? Now, safety helps me a lot. The best ones I'd recommend out of all of these filters are probably safety, middle linebacker, uh, wide receiver, running back. All right? Those are an OT. Those are probably the best filters for this method all right now the last filter i'm gonna get into all right i'm gonna be opening 100k worth of pro packs and i'm gonna show you guys why all right so i'm gonna be talking through all of these pro packs now what these pro packs can give you right now so you no know, there's obviously it's the weekend right now so obviously you know you can pull legends you can pull elite players like always all right but legends are only on the weekends so you can pull legends out of this uh these packs we get an entree for turkey right there you know get, 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 get that turkey cook give, give, give me some of that put, put some gravy on that kid come sleep stuff that up man but there we get some turkey there um uh so oh there you go we got a kick returner title locket see that would be worth 18k so you want to those these packs are really giving out right now because you can get elite players you can get legend players you can get any program players right now team of the week pro uh football outsiders headliners you can get any of those players so you make a ton of money you'd actually get collectibles for the thanksgiving promo which is really good i um you can also get legend collectibles you can pretty much get anything right now all right now the reason you're going to open these packs is because if you actually don't get anything, there's actually still a chance for you to make your money back. Now, what I mean is by putting all those gold players, all the silver players, and all the bronze players into the trophy set. Now, let's say we don't pull anything good here. 
but we already pulled a Tyler Lockett, so that's already 18K. Now let's do some math. We So we're gonna spend 100K. We've already made back 18K. So now we just need to make that 82K. If we pull a lead, let's say that's worth 30K, all right? So, but that's if we pull one. Ah, no. <laughs> with EA, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> we got four more packs here, but let's say if you pulled a lead player. All right, there we got a Marcus Wheaton, not, not the kick returner. But let's say if you pull an elite player, that would be 60K. Now, if you had all those silver trophy player trade-ins and all the gold for player trophy trade-ins, you'd have one elite trophy. Let's say you only get one. That's 40K. Now you got 40K to make back. 40K to make back. All you really need to do is open the quick sell reward pack. Bang! There you go! We get a Jordan Hicks there. That is our elite player, man. That's what I'm talking about, alright? So there is a Jordan Hicks. He might not be the worth the most, but here's what we got, alright? So that's, uh, skip, skip Cameron Brace, skip Johnny Hager, skip Tony Romo. Um, from there on are all the players we pulled, alright? So let's say I put these players into the gold player trading set, alright? So I'm gonna put them in here, alright? Elite trophies actually go for a ton they go for 22k so let's see what we could get out of this 10 trophy pack all right so we get two gold trophies there now that was not the best pack all right so two gold trophies not the best pack we could have asked for but we pulled the jordan hicks so that's all good all right now we're moving on to the six trophy packs we're gonna open all these six trophy packs see if you can get a quick sell reward pack now what i used to do was i used to open a ton of pro packs right open up these packs sell all the players that are worth a lot right to all make my money and then what i'll do is i put the gold trophies and the silver trophies and bronze trophies into the quick sell reward pack now that's how i got my 500k collectible because think of it if you're really lucky if you pulled an elite player out of those pro packs and then you got 500k out of a quick sell reward pack that means you're making bank. You are making a ton of money, young blood. You are making a ton of money. All right. Now let's go straight into this quick sub reward pack. All right. We're gonna. I'm gonna do the silver trading. But let's say if I manage to get at least, let's say 50k, that will make back all my money. Now imagine if I pulled an elite trophy, which is very possible. All right. That is very possible to get out of that 10 player trophy pack. Even to get that out of the six player trophy pack. Not as uh, possible, but still a chance. All right, so let's open up this quick sell reward. Let's say I get 5k, I'm still not gonna lose a ton of money because this pack method is actually very, very good. All right, we get 11,000 coins. So let's do some math. All right, Hicks probably goes to 35k. All right, Lucky God goes for 18k. So that's 53k right there. Let's say we pulled, let, let's just say we pulled a lead trophy. That would be another 20k. That's 70 something k. That's 73k around. All right. Then we add in this quick sell. All right. That's 80k. Now imagine if I got a quick sell. Imagine if I got more trophies. I would be making money. That was just a really unlucky round. Even if we pull a lead player. And you can get all those other gold players that are worth a lot. So this method is actually really, really good. And you guys can make a ton of money from this method. All right. So. That was the ultimate filter right there. If you guys enjoyed this video, man, make sure you leave a like, make sure you subscribe, and guess what? The goof is out. Peace.